so hello guys my name is William and welcome to start tutorial today I'm gonna show you how to make a cinematic look on your video okay inside of the Adobe Premiere Pro so I'm using Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2014 but you can use your own version okay guys so first of all we need to make the new project okay and then after all you can import your footage before uh, you import your footage I usually manage it by creating a folder and s s probably a sequence hey guys and then I make a sequence HDV 720p it's great for me and I call it my main sequence and then I import my footage guys so here is uh, one of my footage try to import it and after that you can just put it on your sequence keep assisting settings and then scale to the frame size so after that you can um, make the cinematic look on your sequence by um, adding the effect called colorista so it's actually a third plugin from the red giant okay so you can double click on colorista and then you can adjust the exposure maybe you can make it um, a little bit darker okay guys and then you can warm it you can just the shadow, the mid tones, and the highlight. And after that, you can adjust the saturation too. Okay, as you can see here. So you can adjust the saturation, okay guys, and then the hue. Not much, and then the highlight too. Okay, and after that, you can also adjust the shadow on your um, footage and then you can just this vignette too okay and after that you can add the color grading I usually use the mojo okay guys just double click it so it will look more cinematic on your footage and after that you can adjust your mojo maybe you can um, make it look warmer by adjust it the warm it okay guys and then I usually just adjust uh, a few of them such as mojo and warm it and you can blend it to the original to make the result Okay guys so it will look more cinematic and the last thing that you need to do is uh, that you need to um, import the uh, anamorphic aspect ratio look on your footage by importing this um, footage I create the anamorphic look already on the after effect you can download it in on the description below and then you can import and just take the image sequence before your you import on your premiere pro guys and then just click open it and after that we just need to put it above your footage cut so it will look like this and then after that um you can adjust the speed to make it longer just uh, guys sorry um i adjust it with one percent i think that's long enough and after that we can cut it guys by pressing c on the keyboard and just click it hey guys so your footage will look more cinematic and if your footage is too high 
you can adjust the uh, position of your footage by click clicking on your footage right here and then you can make it lower guys so something like this okay guys so it will look more cinematic so that's the way you make your uh, footage cinematic Thank you for watching guys, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe on my channel and see ya.